like a well-oiled machine. These volunteers get to work with meals supplied by Feeding San Diego. And then... They're filling a void for a specific kind of family. Gotcha. Going to the grocery store is just a chore, you know, um, especially when he's not home to help watch the kids. It definitely can't work right now because they're all home out of school. Kayla John's husband is in the Navy and he was deployed when COVID hit. She's now home with their three kids, not working, struggling to make ends meet. Sometimes, you know, you question yourself on whether or not you're making the right decisions, um, you know, and whether or not to keep them home or let them go out to a beach or something because of the gas it takes to get to the beach. So she comes to this weekly food distribution at the Armed Forces YMCA for military families. Five meals for each child means not having to worry about basic human needs. It's allowed us to afford things we wouldn't have been able to afford because we would have been spending the money on food. I was able to get my kids their Halloween costumes. Um, I was able to get a printer for their distance learning at home. And in a time when the need has increased, so has efficiency. But COVID-19 has, has forced us to make some great changes. I call it the silver lining of COVID-19. Tim Nye, executive director for the Armed Forces Y, says because of social distancing practices and the new drive-up format, they've changed the way they give out food and it's increased distribution by 400%. We're not going to go back to the old way. We're going to stick with the efficient model as much as we can. You're all set. Have a good one. Feeding hundreds of kids every week hoping to help fill this basic human need. Leah Pizzetti, ABC 10 News.